Experiment number 19. Electric Circuits. Objective. This activity aims to construct an electric circuit consisting of base circuit elements and describe how each element affect one another. Resources. One piece circuit experiment board. One piece fixed capacitor. One piece fixed resistor. Two pieces of dry cells. One unit connecting wire. Procedure 1. Use two pieces of wire to make connections between the springs on one of the light bulbs to the spring on the D cell in such a way that the light will glow. 2. Reserve the two wires at the light. Does this have any effect on the operation? Reverse the two wires at the cell. Does this have any effect? 3. In the following steps. Use a vacant spring connection such as one of the three around the transistor socket shown below as a switch. Connect one lead from the battery to this spring and then take the third wire from the spring to the bulb. You can now switch the power on and off by connecting or not connecting the third wire. 4. Use additional wires as needed to connect a second light into the circuit in such a way that it is also lighted. 5. If you can devise another way of connecting two lights into the same circuit. Try it out. 6. Design a circuit that will allow you to light all three lights with each one being equally bright. 7. Devise a circuit that will light two bulbs at the same intensity, but the third at a different intensity. 8. Connect a single D cell to a single light as in step 1, using a spring clip switch to allow you to easily turn the current. 9. Connect the circuit shown in the figure below. 10. Connect the circuit shown in the figure below. 11. Connect the circuit shown in the figure below. Data and results. Observations There are two kinds of configurations we can use in the experiment. Parallel circuit a positive to positive and negative to negative connection. Series circuit a positive to negative and vice versa connection. We can control the flow of electricity. Conclusion An electric circuit is a closed path where electrons flow. The electric circuit may be connected in series or parallel. The same current flows through each element as in a series configuration. While in parallel configuration the same potential difference occurs across each element. The battery is the device that gives energy to electrons constituting the current. 